guys, welcome to Mama Seo's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make japchae. It's a Korean traditional dish and we use it for every special occasion. But one of the uh, reasons that we don't cook it all the time because it's it takes a lot of time and um, preparing because we have to cut up all the veggies and um, you know saute it separately and boil the noodles and cook it all together and season it and so on. But today I'm going to show you how to cook this within uh, less than 20 minutes, I think think on our iCook and um, our iCook is I always say you know it's a seven layer pot that has an even heat throughout the whole uh, pot so you know you don't have to stir it as often you and you know it cooks very quickly on a low heat okay so for you to get it started I have cut uh, many colorful veggies in julienne style. Uh, I had some uh, bell peppers, onions, and portobello mushrooms, and uh, different type of mushrooms that I added, and green pepper as well, and spinach, half a bunch of a spinach, and I have um, japchae noodle, and it's actually a sweet potato noodle that you will find in an Asian market, and I soaked it in water for uh, about 30 minutes. Okay, so let's get started here. I'm going to, um, I already added some meat in here and I'm going to heat it. And it was just meat um, that it's going to be cooked. It's uh, cut in strips and you could cut it in strips you like or find the ones already cut. So I'm going to heat the meat in a um, grapeseed oil. Okay, and going to stir. And let it cook a little bit and see how uh, beef is cooking. And on top of that, I'm going to layer my veggie, which, you know, onions first. And you could use, I used the purple onions today, but you could use the white onion. And veggies, a little bit of veggies. And I'm going to add the um, noodles on top. Rest of the noodle, uh, veggies in here. Portobello mushrooms, carrots, bell peppers. Okay. And season. Now, the recipe of season, you'll see it in the uh, instruction of my YouTube video, but it has it combines soy sauce, oyster sauce, sesame seed oil, some cooking wine, and sugar. And it's just very tasty. Okay, I'm gonna pour it on top. Put a lid on, make sure that it's on a medium heat, and I'll tell you exactly how long it takes for uh, it to get ready. And the uh, lid's gonna heat up, and it's gonna dance around and tell me when it's ready. Okay guys, it exactly took about seven minutes, okay? And look at my lid. It spins like it's glide. it glides on the ice, right? So I'm going to open it up. When you open it, and look at how it's steamy. And the veggie create a lot of liquid. And I'll mix it a little bit like that. And lower the heat to simmer. And I'm going to add that half a bunch of a spinach. Okay? And leave it for, put the lid on, and I turned it to simmer. And I'm gonna leave it for a couple minutes. Okay guys, here's the finished product, japchae. It's a traditional dish that we cooked it less than 20 minutes, including preparation. And if you want to check um, um, more of my products, check out at amway.com slash robbyseo, R-O-B-I-S-E-O. Until next time, have a nice day. Bye.